Morning body coach, how are you? Day, I've forgotten what day it is already. <laughs> three or four, I think it's three. Yes, because I started on Saturday, day three. So I went to the pictures last night and saw the showman, the greatest showman for the third time. Honestly, it's just so good. I'm going to try and see it again before it goes off. And yes, I decided beforehand during the day that I would have my Cherry Garcia ice cream. Like I said yesterday, I've done eating plans before and when I've been on and off diets and, you know, I go to the pictures, sat with my natural yoghurt and my fruit and it just doesn't, you know, I love a Ben and Jerry's Cherry Garcia. So I had it and I made the decision, but I'm not starting again because I've decided this plan I'm going to fit around my life because I'm doing it just to get myself back in the habit you know, of, of eating proper food and and just feeling feeling great and empowered. And for me, that empowers me knowing that I can have an ice cream, that I did, you know, it's not going to ruin it. It's how I deal with it the next day. I don't let it press that effort button. We all know, I'm sure we all know that feeling. You know, you could, I remember the old days when I used to be on and off diets all my adult life. Again, apart from the six years that I was just free from that diet trap. And you remember sticking to this diet and you'd eat, you know, one of the children's bits of mashed potato, you know, as you were clearing the plates for a chip. And literally that little thing was enough to make me go, oh, sod it now, I've ruined it. I mean, I could sit and chat to you for hours about diet mentality, I tell you. I've seen it all. I used to be a Slim and World consultant years ago and the things you do. But I'll, I'll spread it out over the 90 days. <laughs> the stories that a lot of you will recognise. <laughs> Don't get me going. I'll save it for another one. But yeah, so no, I had my ice cream, but I came home and I had my chicken curry. And my food was prepped. I'm going to have the same. Oh, I had the frittata yesterday and I had it cold from the day before with salad in the car because I just, I was rushing a bit. Oh my God, it was delicious. On my way to the pictures, actually. It was just so good. So I've got the third lot to have today. So I'm going to have similar food today to what I had yesterday, minus the ice cream, because I'm not going to the pictures today. And that's what I want to get out of, that mindless eating that I've just, it's become such a bad habit again. And like I said, I didn't have it for six years. But when you're in it, your whole world is not as good when, when you're in that mentality. You know, when you've no mojo, you can't be asked exercising. But I got up at five o'clock this morning. I like to get up early because that's where I make time to do my fitness. I got up at five o'clock. I did my 25 minute hit. I'm loving, loving, loving these um workout so much better than the last plan that i attempted three years ago to actually physically have i mean i'm a fitness instructor so i know what to do i've got my own hip workouts that i do you know but i just love having somebody else and being told what to do and it's just so clear and well laid out i absolutely love it so thank you for that that's worth every penny to start with so um yeah, and then I did some work and then I did half an hour's yoga stretching, which is my commitment to myself. And then I've just done an hour and a half walk. So I'm just about to have a bath. I work for myself, so my time's flexible. So I know it's uh, 10 to 10 and I'm just about to have a bath on a Monday morning. I know it's a bit odd, but then I'm working all day. So anyway, yes, yeah, so ice cream was had completely guilt free. And it was, you know, I, I do lots of walking. I don't even want to compensate for it. I don't want to get into that mentality. I had it and enjoyed it. So move on, you know, and see when the next little little thing is. Anyway, I'm waffling and uh, I got so wet. So ignore the stay to me. <laughs> My hair will be back to normal soon. But I love reading your posts and yeah, I'll let you into a few little diet mentality stories and what we, mainly as women, some men, but the things we do and the things that you'll have no doubt done. <laughs> Let me just give you a clue. Let me just give you a clue. And if you've ever been to diet club, I used to call it fat club. I know it's not politically correct, so I don't want to offend anybody. But, you know, I used to be a lot bigger years ago. I'll show you a picture sometime. Oh, not only when I had children. I didn't just make children. It looked like eight other people's as well. But, um, you know, going going to Slimming World, who goes on the first week? wearing the jeans <laughs> and then when you go on the second week you put your leggings on so you've got guaranteed weight loss right there don't tell me you haven't done it <laughs> god i've got so many of those i could share with you all right then and that's what i'm free from doing stuff like this i don't see this as the same at all all right then i will speak to you soon bye oops god.